Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Robertina in case you are new here and today I want to do a haul for the month of September. I'm sitting here because the sun is really coming in strong. It's in the evening around 4 4:30 to 5 p.m. Yeah, so I was in town earlier and I need to unpack my shopping as quickly as possible because of the perishable goods, things like veggies, stuff that needs to be washed. Yeah, so I need to handle this right away before it's dark. This is the last weekend uh, before schools open and of course uh, there was a lot of commotion in town like in the supermarkets I had to go twice to different supermarkets because at some point I was in one supermarket it was so full of people and I had to like cut short my shopping there and go to another supermarket which had a bit less traffic but nonetheless a lot more people still but it was much easier and faster for me yeah so I want to do a haul for the month of September and I want to do it as quickly as possible you guys already know the drill for the veggies I'm going to wash them I've done a video um, detailing how I store my groceries in the fridge yes and uh, some of the items most of that is just what I have bought we have tomatoes oranges apples some maize and um, what else avocados you know fruits and cooking veggies all right so I will not go into that today and I hope you will bear with me for that also for the rest of the shopping it's just arranging them in their respective places yes and I'm actually working on getting some storage containers and hopefully that will be in a different video not in this video so I'll just show you what I got and then uh, I will um, arrange everything back uh, into its place you know like the way i usually put if it's the soap where they usually go if it's the uh, food stuff where they usually go things like that okay so i want i won't make it very very long all right so let's get right into it and by the way if you are new here make sure that you subscribe uh join this channel uh become um become a subscriber to this channel by subscribing and putting the bells on so that every time I upload a new video you're among the few people who not the few like you're among everyone who gets a notification because they have their notification bell on all right so if you're new here make sure that you subscribe put the bell on so that every time I post every time I have a new video or a community post or a short video you are notified okay yeah, so without any further delays, let's get right into this and I hope that you will enjoy. From the dust I was born to the dirt I shall return When my eyes are closed in the shadows My enemies will think they won but I'm here to stay Destiny going to start from this corner over here I have some uh, green peas these are minji all right these are I don't know if it's a kg or a kg and a half they are those containers that they sell you in so I got three of them and each was a hundred shillings so this is a whole 300 bob worth of green peas and then down here I have some maize one maize was going for 15 shillings but I bargained and got uh, one two three four five six seven eight eight pieces for a hundred bob I have some pineapples pineapples are cheap because this one is 80 shillings as well as this one and then I have some cucumber here can't remember the price I just got two of them for things like salads and then there's coriander here I need to take care of this before they go bad yeah and then what else I have some carrots I got some carrots as well I got one kg of carrot usually I don't buy a lot of carrot just in just one kg takes us through uh, quite a while maybe like two weeks you know yeah and then over here I have these onions spring onions i want to plant some but uh not now 
so these ones are going to be for consumption these ones are uh, each piece was going for 10 shillings like this this is 10 bob so i got five of them and while this the same lady who sold them to me sold me uh these um uh, this is mint yeah but it looks like it needs some good taking care of anyway so i also got some mint this is 20 shillings right then uh right here i have some ginger ginger and garlic okay so i'm i've i've become accustomed to buying local garlic as opposed to the imported one because i believe in i believe that this one or rather i feel like this one tastes much much better if you see if you're in soko if you're in the market you will see that it has some uh bit it has a different color the other garlic is purely white like the clove the clove covers or what do you call them they are purely white okay so there's that and that so on this side i have thorn melon i ha i got just two and these ones i found them to be really nice the last time i got them i really enjoyed them and uh the secret uh if i may say if you have many of them i can't buy a lot because uh the space in my fridge is really small and i don't want them to spoil so i just buy two and let them stay until they turn orange like they're completely ripe okay so over there there's that then i got tomatoes uh tomatoes i just got i got two kgs i normally get two kgs of tomatoes and then i got some pixie oranges which have already been eaten yeah so we have the pixies uh we i got apples i'm yet to wash these things so don't worry i'm going to wash them the way i usually do i will link a video up here so that you can see how i usually wash and store them okay so i also got some tangerines tangerines are still in season and they're really good the kids really love them okay then we have this tree tomato i got a good deal these ones are going for the way they pack them like in packs of four or five at 40 shillings okay yeah, and then uh, i have some green pepper capsicum whatever you call it there i have it i got uh, i think i have four i bought four of them also got some lemons uh what else is here yeah that's it and then we have the watermelon i like to buy my watermelon full there's a place that i usually ensure that if i'm in the supermarket i have no worries at all like uh, i'll just pick any anyone that feels like it has a lot of juice and i don't know how to measure that but the guys there know so i usually just tell them pick the one that is very juicy and sweet and then uh, but if i'm in the market like this time around i just also the same process i tell the guy who's selling to find me the best one the one that's sweet and because i don't want him or her to cut it like the one who was selling me this one was telling me and i was like no don't cut what if it's not sweet and i don't want the watermelon anymore so he cut a different piece and it was really nice next i have some avocado these are not ripe but i know they will ripen with time i got four of them and i know they will ripen at the same time but i usually put them in the fridge in case you are wondering how i will manage them after they are ripe not not the case where you have so many ripe avocados and you have to eat all of them at once so uh once they start becoming soft i'll just put them in the vegetables compartment in the fridge and they will stay stay there fresh long enough until we get to uh, consuming them okay so i think with the green veggies we are done with the restock i have some potatoes but i didn't buy the potatoes from the market because there's a guy who is going around selling potatoes from his farm so another thing i got was these onions this is one kg onion and i don't know about your place but here in nanyuki these onions are selling so expensively I thought the price would have gone lower but yeah I got these at 170 in the market I don't know the other places how much there there are even places that are selling at 180 okay so I got those onions as well I also have some grapes they look really fresh and one thing I realized with buying grapes you have to look at the twig make sure it is green that means your grapes are fresh okay and then we also have some bananas here so as you can see this one has been here for maybe two days it was in the fridge and the twig you can see it was green but uh, it's changing the color okay so we need to finish this at least today 
that you can get on this one so moving on to the items i got from the supermarket to begin i have sugar okay i got there's some items that i got from quick mart some items that i got from chieni supermarket so if you're in anyuki you can relate so this sugar is at uh, chieni 230 shillings and then here actually i had forgotten this is rice three kgs of rice i i bought this rice the first time in the market the lady who sold it to me if you're in Anyuki, please, when you're in Soko, just look for the lady called Charity and she will sell you really nice rice, okay? So, this is the rice. And for quite a while, I've been buying my rice from the market. It's so good. You have to, of course, you have to look for things like uh, stones and all that so that your kids don't eat stones like it, it smells amazing the aroma is so sweet even like just now i can feel the beautiful scent i don't know Sujuni <laughs> rice gani i just tell her give me that rice that you usually give me three kgs this will last me for the whole month or rather last us for the whole month okay so there's the rice and then over here i have vaseline blue seal nothing much to say about it have some shoe polish because what we have is almost finished uh, i also got this um this uh uji flower it has green banana uji it's a green banana uji flower it's really nice it's actually the reason i went to chini supermarket because i wanted to get it the one i have here is already finished and i needed to restock okay so there's that i got this is the 500 gram one and this is the 1 kg one this so next i have uh, i don't want to move things around i have this um maize flour raha i decided to close my eyes and just stick to one brand because there are so many brands of unga and when you try something that you've never used before you find that it's uh really bad the last time i bought uh you know the normal uh, maize meal not the premium one like uh, the likes of soko jogo dollar and all that i had bought soko i don't know if it's the place i bought but it was bad it was really bad that was a bad experience and i wasn't happy with it so i i switched to there's one called hefra in nanyuki and if i can't find hefra i will buy this they are almost the same and then right here i have a really nice deal um dollar vegetable cooking oil this oil is on offer in a place in a supermarket in many supermarkets some places are selling it for 12.50 but if you find the the right supermarket you will get it at 1k okay another cooking oil that is on offer as well is rina rina 1k right now at quick mart is 999 so not a big difference okay so that's uh that's the cooking oil that i that i got next year i have some headbands rubber bands for my kids my baby girl's hair i bought bread as well and then i got some witterbix okay just to restock on what we have witterbix really comes through for us uh on days you know for breakfast days when we don't have like bread or milk nearby so witterbix comes through with yogurt okay and then another thing that i got is this curry powder also got some multivitamin syrup for the kids so it has eight essential vitamins is a seven c's brand i want to try it with the kids and see how uh, they react to it actually i never really buy supplements for my kids that will be like maybe the second time since i started having kids and then i went for this tomato onion kachumbari uh sauce i think it will be really nice especially if you just want that kachumbari taste yes and uh, that's it okay so another thing that i got is um i wanted the jelly the, the petroleum jelly but i couldn't find it so i decided to buy this one because even aside from the kids i'm the one who mostly uses this mosquito repel repellent okay and then the other thing i got some lotion i don't use lotion a lot but i just wanted this one because of the cucumber and green tea scent by dove because the dove uh shower gel the one 
the one the one flavored uh, with fresh cucumber and green tea scent it smells amazing and i'm hoping this is going to smell just as good right now i don't have any shower gel i'm using the Dettol even tone uh bar soap and that is working just fine for now uh, yeah so it was a buy one get get one free yeah so that's why i decided to buy it it's a small pack you can see it's fitting on my on my palm yeah so it's not a big but because i don't really use lotion that much another thing i got is a gold band uh spreadable margarine wow uh, how much was this this was around 300 and something 45 345 at quick mat it's it wasn't available at cheney okay so if you're in cheney and you're looking for gold band uh just know that it's not there look for it at quick mat or chandarana here in Anyuki. okay so the next thing i got is um i got this um cantu shea butter but this one i got on jumia i had brought this one here i actually got several of them so i'm going to just actually put it away right now because i want to do a separate video for those products the cantu products that i bought for my hair and my baby girl's hair differently in a different video okay so now we have yogurt right here this time i bought uh gracie's yogurt if you don't know there's this yogurt called gracie and my kids love that yogurt it is so thick it's so nicely made and uh, in as much as we love the those top brands uh, the kinds of jolly yogurt uh what do you call them ilara <laughs> other ones oh my god i can't remember de la mer those are all favorite yogurts but uh in the estate here the place where we live in the shops they have their grace's yogurt and you know this yogurt this brand was voted the second was it the first runners up yogurt product in the whole of kenya so tell me if you come across it if you like it personally here we love it and um that's why I decided to buy the strawberry and the vanilla one because uh, my son loves the strawberry and my daughter loves the vanilla one. <laughs> Kids and their flavors. Yeah, so everyone here is already sorted. So another thing I got was juice. I bought Savannah Punch. I want it to last quite a while. I wanted to replace the Ribena one because Ribena is quite expensive. Ribena is around... 599 for just one liter and this is two liters it was less than that by half i guess okay so another thing i got is a vinegar you know for what for cleaning salads has many uses okay yeah and then we have some meal bakers cake i got three packets this is one and then the second one the third one we already ate it okay <laughs> So another one, another thing we got is this toothbrush. I found a lady at Cheney Supermarket doing promotions uh, for this brand, Pepsodent. And since I already have a toothpaste, I did not need to restock it. So that's why I decided to just take the toothbrush because we actually need uh, to replace one toothbrush in this house. Yeah, normally for us, with toothbrush, we just buy here in the shops. They sell cheaply, 70 shillings, 80 shillings. Within three months, you change because anyway, you have to change your toothbrush after every three months, all right? Yeah, so there's that. Then I also went for these uh, soft care sanitary pads. I had never tried tried them before until last month and they are really good they have this opening here and they come with two they come with two free something i can't remember what it has two two free panty liners all right yeah it's right here written here it's really nice I, I love the packaging they have gone all in with the packaging it is very convenient very effective and uh i really love it so in case you're wondering why i bought one I have I already have another one in the house yeah another thing I got is this star soft fabric softener this one will last me the last time I bought this was maybe at the beginning of the year all right and I usually over dilute let me tell you I over dilute this is supposed to make two liters of fabric softener but I don't really like that strong scent it smells amazing I'm not saying that it doesn't smell amazing this thing especially this passion uh, passion one it smells beautiful it's so amazing like when you have it that you know how passion 
you know the scent of passion so imagine it as a fabric softener and then when you use it to wipe surfaces wipe your floors uh you know like the final rinse of your clothes everything smells amazing but for me i usually like that scent to be you know like mkombali kwe kombali not very not very strong i just want you to get like a whiff of that scent not like that's the dominating scent all over the place so i usually over dilute it to five liters and we use very little of that over diluted one <laughs> if that is a trick that you can use okay so the other thing i have here is the detol even tone focus yeah the even tone pomegranate you already know our favorite soap buy two get one free and then i found these these wipes these wipes would you guess how much they were they were 80 shillings 82 shillings at quick mat if you have a quick mat near yourself oh maybe this offer is already gone jesus i'm sharing offers which are uh active end of august i hope by the time you see this video you will be able to grab some offers okay so here it is nip nap baby wipes they say it is fragrance free that's why i bought it because i don't really like scented wipes with my kids yeah and uh it's heavy meaning it is well moisturized so another thing what is the last last thing we have here so here we have uh Uh, I decided to restock on the parcel. Oh no 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 no! I've just remembered why it was wrapped like that. It was leaking. Oh, that's a big mess. But no worries. I just wipe it off after. I just need to make sure I'm holding it well. I won't even turn it. So we have the deep clean parcel, one kg, which right now at Quick Mart is selling at 290. 279 it's a good offer go grab it personally lately they have been giving out offers and i really like that because i've really come to love this particular one the the personal lavender one so the last thing here although i'm not done is uh of course mall fix diapers this time i decided to go for baby pants i want to start training my daughter yes so i want to start training her and i thought the pants this is the right time she already know how, knows how to remove her trouser and all that but i want her to know when and how to remove pants so i'm going to be using this and i bought just one packet which has 56 pieces i already have another packet the other normal diaper which uh is uh, 64 pieces and usually for me i don't use a lot of diapers this packet if i have to replace it by the time i do another shopping maybe just once okay and then uh, from quick mat i also got their tissue the quick mat premium tissue it's so nice the quality is good and the price is also really fair all right so this is everything that i got there are some more things which are in the freezer uh <coughs> I'll, I'll show you quickly there are some more things which are in the freezer let me just show you uh, right now So here I have beef brown. I haven't organized this freezer, so bear with me. And then I have these bites. These are, let me just remove them and show you Vizuri. Oops, please don't fall. So these are chicken bites. And then here I have uh, some chicken, farm fresh, all natural, no hormones. So this is. Uh, this is chicken and then over here i bought some gizzards okay yeah so that's it that's everything the other thing is, is this beef brown two of them i got two of them all right then we haven't had cleaning water from the taps for the past few days and that's why everything is outside i'm washing the veggies outside so i won't be able to record that but as you can see we have a really uh you know hard situation with water but we are managing it from the darkness to the light i feel alive i'm a fire
All the pain, all the hurt, all the lessons I have learned I am stronger now, I won't let me down, no Thank you for watching the whole video that means a lot to me i really appreciate it it means a lot that you took your time to watch my video see what we got for the month of september and i hope that you got you saw some items that you also use if you have some alternatives that you can share with me please leave them in the comment section and i will really appreciate that yes and i hope that i will catch you in my next video remember to subscribe like this video share with a friend and i will really appreciate may god bless you bye bye I love you.